Hello friends, it is Miss Fushi and we are back with Star Dew Valley. Just a quick special announcement, we recently made it to 5,000 subscribers, yay! <laughs> I did a little milestone video, which released on Sunday, if you wanted to check that out. It is not ASMR, but it is very special to me. Now, I did have one of my, um, Sebi friends mention to me that we should click the E button multiple times on the start menu for a little easter egg. So, we are going to do that. I think it was Jordan who told me. Oh! <laughs> Look at those cute! It was a little alien. Okay. I think that's it. Yeah, just the one. Let's go ahead and load into the game. And we did find out that we cannot get the sewer key from Gunther until until we give him 60 artifacts. So, alas, we cannot do that. It'll be quite some time before we can go into the sewer. Weather report. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. Fortune teller. I sense a new viewer has joined us, a young lady from Stardew Valley. Welcome, welcome. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. I'm the Queen of Sauce. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret handbook. Cookbook. <laughs> this week's dish. Poleslaw. Envisioning bland mounds of limp cabbage? You're not alone. But a great coleslaw can be so much more. Make sure you have juicy, fresh cabbage for this one. Toss with a little vinegar and mayonnaise, and you're all set. Ah, that's crisp. You learned how to cook coleslaw. <gasps> Yay! We're so accomplished. So, ooh, that's right, we can pick up our cauliflower. In the last episode, we got a whole bunch of strawberry seeds. So we can now plant tons of strawberries. Very happy about that. I wonder if we should try and use our green stuff. Let's see. Look at that. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Beautiful. We did a pretty good job, guys. Cool. And I think we're getting close to being able to afford the silo, which I am totally hyped for. I can't wait. I feel like once we start getting animals, this farm will really feel like it's in motion. Oop, <laughs> there's nothing there. But there's stuff here, though. So I'm really hyped for that. I've also been um, spending a little time playing in the farm planner. So I think I might go in there and try and look at some ideas for the farm. Maybe we can plan something out. That fire burns forever. I wonder if it ever goes out. I don't mind if it doesn't. I think it's pretty cool to have a little fire in the middle of the field. Maybe we can make it look really cute with some flowers and stuff like that. I wonder if I can make this in the form of outdoor seating. Oh, there's our meowth up in the corner. Hi, Nemo. Goodness. We're getting pretty good at this watering stuff. So, I think we're getting pretty close to being able to... I'll sell the bread. That will feel a need to hold on to it right now. But I think we're getting pretty close to be able to afford the silo. We do need some more money though, but we've got stone, clay, a copper bar. Mm hmm. Let's see. Oh, we should have saved that parsnip and cauliflower. Can I get it back out? I don't think so. Oh, well, I can get the parsnip back out. Not the cauliflower. We've got some more growing. It's gonna be okay. Oh, 
Alright, off to town we go. We're very close to being able to get that silo. I think we needed to have ten clay and a copper bar. I think so. I could be wrong, but I do think so. <gasps> yes. Sweet. We got more clay. When in doubt, dig for worms. Yes. All these helpful tips you guys are giving me are very useful, so I do appreciate them. I've been implementing a lot of advice that you guys give me, which is wonderful. It makes it a lot easier. It makes me feel like I've got people looking out for me while we play. Let's see. That's right, it was. This one up here, wasn't it? Yes. We did it. Cool. So now cauliflower and green beans. We're so close, you guys. Yes, so close. Cauliflower and green beans. Did we see green bean seeds? I don't know if we did. We should go look for some. We'll see if Pierre has any here. And check the signboard, too. I require an eel for potion making. Oh, well, we are not very good at fishing yet. So, I don't think so. Excuse me. Do you have bean seeds? Green bean seeds. No. Bean starter? Are those the green beans? Those must be it then. Hmm. They probably are and I just didn't notice. Sometimes I get so silly and I don't pay attention to anything that I should. There we go. Perfect. Let's go check the trash cans and then go see if we have what we need yet. To make the silo. While digging in everyone's garbage. Mwah. Oh, we can check the beach too. That's right. There's always goodies down at the beach. And these gravestones here remind me of the Count Lucanor. That's another game I've been playing recently in one of my normal Let's Plays. I like that game a lot. The Count Lucanor. <gasps> oh, a seashell. Got it. Let's see if we can find anything else on this beach. Another seashell. Got it. Anything else down here? Any worms? Yes. Got it. Got it. Wonderful. Anything down here? Nope. I always like to look just in case. I wonder. It still says we haven't met that guy. Even though we talked to him at the egg festival. Unless he's not the guy. Oh, there. Hello, I hope your new farming life is panning out as you'd hoped. Elliot. He looks super anime there. We did it. Oh, give someone a gift. Um, do you want a flower? Hmm, I'm not a huge fan of this. But you still took it. Got it. Sweet. Level 40 in the mine and getting a coop. We are so close. So close. I wonder how much it costs to get a coop. I think it was like a thousand or something like that. Or a, sorry, a silo, I mean. Excuse me. Please buy my shells. Thank you. You're so nice. I installed an easier fishing mod. What does that mean? Should we go through the fishing pole in there? It's like all bubbly there. Let's, let's see. No. Not quite. I wonder what that means. Maybe we should just wait and see if we catch something. Anybody there? Oh, it went away. I have a feeling that was something special. 
I think I missed it because I threw it in and I got the mark on my head and then I didn't pull it in. Darn, guys. I'm sorry if I missed it. Ah, I stepped in something gross earlier and I just bought these shoes. That's unfortunate. I hate it when that happens. Off on an adventure to get a silo. But first I'm gonna check your garbage. And I got some trash. Awesome. <laughs> Alright. Let's see if we have enough. All these butterflies are so pretty. I love them. Let's find out. Supplies? No. <clears throat> oh, that's right. Wrong place. Oops. We need to go to the carpenter. And they are... Up there. Oh my goodness. Fushi, what are you doing? Are you drunk? You're crazy. They're gonna watch this video and say... I can't possibly be relaxed when she doesn't know where she's going. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, everyone. I'm always bound to forget things. I'm a very... I can be a very, um, intellectual individual, but then I can also come off as incredibly flighty. Excuse me. Oh, she doesn't want to talk. Today I'm just going to relax and think positively. Good idea, Caroline. That is always a noble use of a day. To think positive. There we go. Farm buildings. Let's see here. A silo. We need more copper bars. That's what we need. Challenge accepted. Let's go get some copper and some coal. Because I cannot wait for us to be able to build this silo. I really want to within this episode. We've got a little time, so let's go down, down deep in here. Using the elevator. Two, five. Come on. Never. No. No. <laughs> no. Oh gosh. No. Oh. Goodness gracious. Okay. Now to mine. Let's see if we can get anything. It's all dark in here. Why is it all dark? I don't know. Is it supposed to be like this? It's really spooky. I don't remember it being dark before. Oh well. Let's get some stuff and get out. I don't think any of these have it in there. I can't quite see where I'm going. Do you guys think this is a bug? Or how it's supposed to be? Let's see. All oh, those stones. Let's go down another level. What is this? Earth crystal. We need one of those for a quest. Too bad we already failed it. Darn. I guess we'll have to hold on to it. That was a glitch then, because it was so dark. Let's dig here and see if we can find us a carrot. I always wonder if it's better to dig and look for a carrot and waste energy, mathematics wise, or if it's better to just keep on going. Probably better to keep on going. A cave carrot, there we go. Oh, it's getting late. We might not make it. Let's see. A cave carrot? Earth crystal. Oh yeah, we can take it to Gunther. We got some coal. That's good. 
Call is always a good thing. Yes. Call. Got it. Okay. Oh, there's some rocks with stuff in it. Cool. Let's get this big one out of the way. Got you. And then that. And then this one. Man, I love this. All the sticking. Any more cave carrots by chance? Nope, but we got some more clay. Oh no, we're gonna faint. Well, we can keep going with our sword. See if there's any more treasures we can pick up. Before we have to leave. Can we make it around? No, we can't. Oh goodness. I guess we better go back up, guys. Leave the mine. Darn, darn, darn. Okay. So now we've got something that we can give to Gunther. Even though we need a lot more copper. But it's okay. I think we still did good. We managed to give something to the museum, so I think that's pretty good. Every day will be something new. Even if it's not necessarily very exciting. But I'm okay with that. Alright. So let's go ahead and put these items in the inventory down here in our little chest. There we go. We're getting so close. I'll keep that. Keep the stone. Keep the earth crystal because we're going to give that away. We can sell the trash and stuff like that that we don't need. And we'll keep that. Perfect. And then we'll give that to Gunther tomorrow. Hi, kitty. Good little baby. Let's go to the next day. Let's see how much we got. Mm, not very much. I wanted to see how much the bread sold for. 60. Alright. Did we learn anything? I don't think so. Nope. That's alright. Weather report. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. The spirits are in good humor. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Welcome to Living Off the Land. Now we're back again with another tip for you. Now listen up. It's salmon berry season. All across the countryside, bushes are teeming with juicy little berries, and they're free for the taking. Harvesting them is a great way to earn some extra cash. <gasps> I haven't seen any berry bushes. There are berry bushes, guys. Oh, there's our beans. Yay! We can take some and put one in the the thingy me the thingamajigger. <laughs> Awesome. We're so close to computing and com completing the next thing in the community center. All we need to do is get that cauliflower that I sold. Like a silly. I really should make lists. Lists should be my new best friend. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We're gonna need to go and get more water, won't we? I think we will. Da -da -da. We have to get that silo soon. I want it so bad. I wish we could just buy copper. I wonder if we can. Maybe we could buy some from the blacksmith. It's probably very expensive though. I'm betting it is. But we could always see. There's no harm in that. Watering extra plants. Perfect. We got it. Hello, dear. I know you're just getting started as a gardener, so I wanted to give you a little tip. Most crops only grow in one season. When summer arrives, your spring crops will all die out. So plan ahead. Oh, look at me out up there. Looking so cute. Okay. So we need to think about our crops. Definitely. Oh, so many flowers. Tons of flowers. 
perfect. Then we got some of these. But you can always eat them in the mine. But first, I'm gonna go see if that um that guy sells copper bars. Cause if he does, maybe we could get some and be a little lazy. I don't mind you. They said there were berries in the bushes. But I don't see any. Should I click the bushes? Maybe they're special bushes that have berries on them. That's what I would do. Make special bushes with berries on them. Let's see. There we go. You guys were so close. So close. We just need that cauliflower. If only I hadn't. If only I hadn't been silly like that and gotten rid of it. Let's see, blacksmith is down this way. So let's go check him out. Oh, there's a berry bush. Guys, did you see that? Look, it is a berry bush. <gasps> we got berries, oh man. So it is special bushes that give you berries. That is so cool. I didn't know that was a thing. Wow. Hey, it's a Jojo Mart. Should we go inside? Tune. Whoa. Hey. Oh, they sell stuff here too. And it's really cheap. Hmm. Shane's hard at work. He doesn't seem interested in talking. Hmm. Let's talk to this guy. Welcome to Jojo Mart. How are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris, Jojo Customer Satisfaction Representative. So he's that guy. When you decide you want to be a Jojo member, I'll be delighted to help make your transition a joyous experience. Never. I don't ever want to be a member of the Jojo Company. It's such a sad thing. I don't want this town to become destroyed. Let's see. Excuse me, sir. Shop. Oh, you sell copper ores. Hmm. I wonder. Do you? Hmm. It's not very cost effective, is it? No, it's not. Well, I did a few. I patroned your company, sir. And now we have... Gunther. Gunther, I have something for you. Donate. This. There we go. You're welcome. <laughs> I wish he acknowledged that we donated something and was like, Good job, thank you. You're so cool. And I'd be like, You're welcome. I am cool. I like to donate to my neighborhood museum to make it a better place. So, we've got a lot of different items now. <gasps> More berry bushes. Yay. Got another berry. Sweet. Let's go check the beach. And then we could sell stuff. And then we could go on a mine adventure. And see if we can get the last bit of the clay that we need. I'm not holding out hope. I haven't had good luck so far in the mines. But we have a lot of items to sell now. So much. Tons of items. This is really cool. Yeah, look at all that stuff. All those goodies. Goodies to sell. Can we sell those in the normal shop too? That seagull is licking himself, like, let me clean my feathers. I don't see any bubbly fishing spots. There you go, sir. I found this stuff right on the beach, right where you are. It's funny that he buys that. If I were him, I wouldn't, since, you know, I could just walk a few feet and get it myself. Achoo. Whoa. You guys, we got another artifact. What? That's awesome. 
I'm all excited about the other artifact. We can go to need that too. I wonder how many there are. There's a lot, obviously, because of all that space that we can fill up. I keep trying to use my sword on things. Hello, Gunther. We have another thing. You're welcome. I'm so good at donating to the museum. I'm like a museum pro right now. <laughs> okay. Now we need to go up to the shop. We got a sunfish from the trash can. <laughs> hey, stop that. When she's not looking. Oh, I can't do it again. <laughs> we just can't get caught. A pine cone. What? This is crazy. Excuse me. Okay. There we go. And now we have a fish. Well, we can eat the fish or we can sell the fish. Is this a fish that we can put into the place? Let's see. Um, pantry? Perhaps fish tank? <gasps> we can! Oh, sweet! This day is going so great. It's like my favorite day. At least things are all working out. And now we can go put the fish in there, because we didn't even have to catch it. We found it in the trash can. <laughs> there we go. You're welcome. Excellent. Now the last thing we have left to do is to go mine, because we need more copper. Lots of copper and coal. And then we can raise our hands in victory and get our silo. And we found a bone flute. I cannot believe we just got another artifact. If you guys are not digging in the ground, you need to make it a priority, because clearly you can find so much stuff. How much do these berries give us? Wow. I love these berry trees. This is awesome. Are there any over here? Well, there's a shop. Can you give us a stronger sword? Let's see. Rusty sword and a wooden sword. Sneakers and special rings. I'm gonna try that. Let's see. Put on these shoes. Oh, cute! And it gives us some more defense. So now we're stronger. And we have really cool red shoes. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, that area over there looks really cool. I'll be excited when we can go over there. Okay, guys. We have a limited time to mine, so let's go ahead down and aim for copper. Let's see. Run, run, run. All these bad guys. Let me see. Copper, copper, copper. Or a place to go down. No! sword is better. Oh, I love it so much. We must find a place to go down. Okay. We got some copper there. Ha! Ha! Die, slime! Fall victim to our power. There we go. That That was hard to find. Okay. I will defeat you, mister. Ah. And then I have to get through here. Just kidding. Sweet. Oh, we've got some goodies this way. Excellent. Here we go. That's exactly what we needed. want to 
kick this guy's butt. Oh, we got copper in there too. No. Die, slime. <laughs> it's a lot harder to fight than I thought it would be when I first started to play. Because you really have to, like, get in there. And there's not a whole ton of aiming that makes it easy to aim, so it is a little bit of a struggle. Okay. Time to go back through this way. We can open up that chest and see what's inside. Come here, slime. Got you. Let's go ahead and eat a salmon berry. Sweet. Those are awesome. Get us some more of this. We need to get plenty. And whatever this is. Amethyst. Beautiful. Awesome. And I'll use this since it doesn't use up our energy. Perfect. We got some wood, too. And some more of that. No! Pew, pew, pew. Nyah. Defeated you. <laughs> I wonder which rocks it is that gives us coal, specifically. Keep going down deeper and deeper into the caverns. Always so fast. We don't want to die. Come here. Come here. Sweet. Got it. Excellent. And we've got one here. You've got wood. <laughs> now we can go through this way. blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what might be hidden inside? I know, right? I want to see if I can defeat that guy like that. But instead, we'll just cut off his arms. <sighs> oh, how peaceful we are. Well, it's getting late, guys. You know what that means. We have to head home. But we found so much cool stuff. What if I just peek? I just wanted to peek. Oh no. Oh no. I wish we could go through here, but we have to go home. Let me just break these. Sweet. You got another geode. Worth it. Leave the mine. This way we can leave before we pass out. That was worth it. We got another geode. I wonder what's going to be inside. I'm excited for that. I learned that the things you find in geodes can also be artifacts that you can give to Gunther. So I feel like as long as we stay focused on, um, on the mines and stuff like that, we can find those artifacts and we can get that sewer key. Because I know some people have gotten it, but not a lot of people have. So I'm really excited for that. Oh man, and then the silo. I wonder if we can get it next time. Let's see. Wood. And the stone. Cave carrot. We can eat that. Keep the geode. Let's see. Oh, Gunther can take some of these too. Awesome. But we can sell some. That, that. Keep that. Keep that. Donate? Donate? Well, they're the same. Perfect. And this way we've got all these things that we can donate to the museum. Here, I'll put some of them down here. There we go. Sweet. Then we can also do that. 
make some bars. Awesome. Hi, kitty. Good little baby. Almost done. It's taking its sweet time. Cool. We're so close. We need more coal. I wish it would let us make coal out of wood, like in Minecraft. I would like that very much, but I know it's getting late. Okay, let's go to bed. Yes. <gasps> Look, guys. We got plus one water can proficiency, plus one hoe proficiency. We can make a stone fence and a sprinkler and a mayonnaise machine. We don't even have cows yet. Oh, that's awesome. Let's see how much monies we got. Not very much, but that's okay. Saved. cock a doodle do. <laughs> Just a peek. Is this harvestable yet? Oh, <laughs> no. It's okay. But, yes. That was today's adventure. We wanted to get a silo, and we didn't end up doing that, but we did do a lot of other really cool stuff. So, in tomorrow's episode, we will go to Gunther and turn in all the artifacts, and we will try and get some more coal so we can finally make that silo. And then we can start thinking about where to put chickens and cows and all that other stuff, and because we have the Pokemon mod, I cannot wait to show you guys what the chickens look like. As long as it works correctly, you're gonna you're gonna be pretty excited if you like like um, if you like Pokemon. So yes, if you are enjoying the series, please remember to leave a thumbs up down below, leave a comment as well, and share this video if you know someone who also enjoys ASMR. I only grow with your support. And subscribe for more, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.